could you talk a little bit with regards to Team Lally? You need support and you need help. Um, people are much more willing to help than you would originally think. Um, I think S and C is something that was uh, covered in quite a lot of depth with my coach, or used to be covered in quite a lot of depth with my coach, but it was only me and him. Um, recently, branched out to Southampton so University, and uh, I spoke to them and said, look, I'm trying to get to the Olympics. I've been on the sort of Olympic level, on the cusp of making the team team for the past, well, four years for Worlds and Olympics, um, and I don't want to now miss out. I'm now getting to an age where I really need to start making these teams. It's not, I'm just on the wrong end. Um, and they were keen to help and they asked what sort of things and so SNC was one of them, speak to one of the guys, um, help me out with uh, different exercises, what his views were on kind of the structure of the programme, what I'm doing, what I'm not doing, what things I possibly were missing out on because I'm doing too much of something else. Um, like I said earlier, I can't squat so I do uh, different variations um, of that like leg press lunges. Um, he came up with some uh, uh, hip thrusts and uh, split squat, so it's just different variations, hitting the same muscle groups with different ways of doing it, and that was it was just nice to get a fresh pair of eyes on that. Um, they also helped me out with uh, biomech stuff, which has been really interesting. So I knew it was available um, through UKA, and being a funded athlete, it was um, I knew I knew it was important. I knew other athletes got a lot of that. Um, unfortunately, where it's based in Loughborough, it just isn't close to me, and it's not—it's just not realistic for me to keep travelling up there and trying to get something done with them. Um, whilst they're obviously going to try and manage me and juggle every other every other athlete that is around there, which is more local to them. So it didn't make sense location-wise to go with them. And the university and were just as keen to help me with that as well. So um, to do that with them was something completely new. And me and my coach got a lot from that because all the information there was new. And hopefully after every six weeks or so, I can go then, we can compare and we can really see the progress, hopefully, that I'm making at that point. Um, we looked at, um, well, I, I spoke with a physio there. We looked at some of the things that I'm doing um, uh, uh, recovery-wise. Um, I already have a team for my recovery. So Bridgham Clinic, again, next to where I live or close to where I live. Um, they look at my, well I've got an osteo there um, who's been really good and really helpful and has helped me stay injury free for many years now. Um, I've got a Pilates instructor, um, they also put me in touch with a nutritionist so was, that was quite important and that was quite um, impactful on my, on my life really. Um, so they kind of got the recovery side of things done. I briefed the physio guy in, in Southampton of what I'm having so far. He didn't want to interfere with that, he wanted to help that, he said, okay, well, this is maybe an idea for shoulder range of movement, for back rotation, all things that are important, um, so I could feed that back to Bridgham and say, this is what somebody else thought, what do you think, if it can be used, I'll use it, if there are too many opinions, obviously, on the same thing, then I'll kind of filter out what I think is necessary and what other athletes are doing, so what is a, a key core thing that I do need to work on and what I don't need to work on so much. So I have various people in different sections, like the recovery, like nutrition, uh, like Biomech, like s &C, and my main technical coach, Andy, um, also a uh, assistance coach on that for other technical bits. So everyone has their role, hopefully, in getting me <laughs> to the Olympics. So yeah, it's, it's just a case of everyone marrying up, we've all got the same goal, everyone is going in the same direction.